Today, former President Donald Trump is taking the stand in the $250 million civil fraud trial against him and his company. NBC's Lindsay Reiser has more from New York City. Court is still underway today, but already we have heard some of the defenses that we have heard from the former president in his deposition in this case. For example, saying that those statements of financial condition, the documents that the attorney general's office says contain overvalued assets, that he, the banks knew that those were meaningless, and also saying he didn't really get involved with the nitty gritty like overvaluations. Also, the former president saying that the valuations didn't include his most valuable asset, his brand. But in addition to what we're hearing from the former president, really what is also newsworthy that's taking place inside that court is the asides between the judge and the defense attorneys. The judge several times now having to tell Trump's attorney that they need to control their client, that his answers are too meandering and not responsive to what the attorney general's attorney is asking. In fact, the judge just recently saying, raising his voice saying, I am not here to hear what he has to say. Trump, for his part, saying this is a very unfair trial. Lindsay Reiser, NBC News.